Now, the other day, I had a chance to speak with the interim GM of TikTok, Andy Bonillo, about the relationship that they have with Global Cyber Alliance. They've developed an interactive cybersecurity toolkit for both students and adults in an effort to remind us to be cyber smart. They're also very excited about educating people who wish to have a career in the cybersecurity sector. Hi, Andy. Thank you so much for being here. Yeah, thanks for having me. I'm excited. Appreciate it. Yes, I'm excited too. So let's just jump right in. Can you tell me what does it mean to be cyber smart? Well, cyber, Be Cyber Smart is a campaign that we launched last year uh, in advance of Cybersecurity Awareness Month. For those that don't know, October is Cybersecurity Awareness Month, but we really wanted to make another push around this for back to school. As we know, everybody's going back to school, right? My daughter just went back you know, this week. And so it's a, a hectic time. And we really want to make sure that people are getting educated on being cyber smart and being cyber safe and understanding that the, the cyber risks that exist out there, how to be safe online, uh, and to make sure that they understand that, you know, there's also an opportunity for a career in, in a profession in cybersecurity. So we're excited about Be Cyber Smart. And we're also excited about how TikTok has become a place to learn, not just to be entertained. And so Learn on TikTok has had over 350 billion views, and there's a lot of great educational content there, and people are learning a whole host of things, but we're really focused on, you know, educating our community right now on cybersecurity. That's awesome, and that's actually the hashtag, like, Learn on TikTok. And I think it's so in, important and so interesting, a place like TikTok, previously you guys did the Book Talk Challenge. So it seems like you're really trying to make the connection and relationship with families. And I think that's kind of uh, out of the box idea, because <laughs> I think some families out there, some parents think TikTok is the enemy and their kids are always on it. Um, but why is that so important for you guys to almost bridge that gap? We, we want to meet, you know, families and, ch and children where they are, right? We want we want that connection to happen. Like I have children, I have a, I'm a parent. Um, and so, I, you know, the world that they live in is very different than the world I grew up in. And so it's very important for me to transfer that information to them and make sure they fully understand the environments that they're operating in and where they're, how to protect their digital persona, which is why we started with, or partnered with the Global Cyber Alliance to, you know, help people understand how to have a, you know, protect their online profile in a step-by-step -step guide. And they can walk through and go through their accounts and make sure they know how to be safe online. And, and you know, we've got great online safety tips that I pass on to my children around two-factor verification, use trusted Wi-Fi, you know, strong and unique passwords. Don't share them with anybody, they're yours. Um, and then, you know, make sure you have your auto updates on your devices. Like, it, you know, people are, you know, don't wanna do that and don't wanna constantly update because they think they might break things or lose data. That, that's, you know, we wanna make sure that you're pro providing um, the right security updates to your devices that are connected to the internet. And so we really think it's important for the global community at large to just be more cyber aware um, as cyber actors and cyber criminals are continuously becoming more sophisticated. And so not only are we committed to protecting the platform and the TikTok application in our community as they're with us, you know, in that experience, but we want them to be safe, you know, in all other aspects of their life. Yeah. And I love how previously you touched on kind of kids or any individual really uh, seeking a career opportunity in the cyber world. Tell me a little bit about that and what someone might do to kind of kickstart that career. Yeah, it's an interesting journey. You know, I believe it's a very mission driven field. You know, my, my journey started, um, you know, really at a young age and it wasn't through technology. You know, I, I firmly believe and we at TikTok believe that if you can see it, you can be it. And so my journey into cyber was through law enforcement. I, I saw a lot of police officers, you know, I appreciated the work that they did. And so I entered into the law enforcement field, eventually became a United States Secret Service agent, protected world leaders and presidents, um, you know, of the United States. And so I eventually ended up investigating some of the largest cyber crime cases in the world and just had this unique entrance into this, you know, very fascinating field. Um, when I didn't go to school for it in the beginning. Like I did not set my career out that way, um, but it's a very interesting path. And so I want people to know that there's something for everybody in cyber, whether you're, you know, you were in audit and risk, like our head of TikTok security, Kim Alvarella, she's an amazing practitioner and leader, but she started in audit and, and risk. We have Katie Stefanich on our team who runs business continuity and crisis management for TikTok globally, uh, started out in communications and as a consultant. And so there's very different paths. I, 
I have someone on my team who was an art major who is one of the best security engineers you're ever going to find. And so we're really excited about bringing awareness into this profession. There's 3.5 million jobs that are unfilled in cybersecurity. There's negative unemployment, high job security. And so the mission around protecting the global infrastructure, you know, and how the world inter is interconnected, um, not just on TikTok, but just the global eco interconnected ecosystem is just a really fun, you know, profession. Love that. And I, I just love the message that you guys are putting out and really kind of touching families and incorporating yourselves uh, in all, all of this education. So I thank you so much for being here. And where can people go to kind of get more information on that toolkit that you guys have created? Yeah, go to at, at TikTok Tips and, and then the Global Cyber Alliance website. I think another thing that's really helpful is we also started a TikTok scholarship program. So you can go to cybersity.org and learn more about that. Um, and then if you have an interest in careers, uh, TikTok, please go to careers.tiktok.com. I love it. Thank you so much for being here, Andy. We really appreciate it. Thank you so much for having me. I appreciate it.